Welcome to day 25 of total consecration to Jesus Christ through Mary. Mary communicates her spirit to us. Invocation of the Holy Spirit. Come Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Lord, send forth your spirit and you will renew the face of the earth. O oh God, who instructs the hearts of your faithful with the light of your Holy Spirit, make us responsive to his inspirations so that we may be truly wise and ever rejoice in his consolations. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Scripture 2 Peter 1, 5-8 For this very reason, Make every effort to supplement your faith with virtue, and virtue with knowledge, and knowledge with self-control, and self-control with steadfastness, and steadfastness with godliness, and godliness with brotherly affection, and brotherly affection with love. For if these things are yours and abound, they keep you from being ineffective or unfruitful in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. St. Louis de Montfort To sum up, Mary becomes all things for the soul that wishes to serve Jesus Christ. She enlightens his mind with her pure faith. She deepens his heart with her humility. She enlarges and inflames his heart with her charity, makes it pure with her purity makes it noble and great through her motherly care. But why dwell on this? Experience alone will teach us the wonders wrought by Mary in the soul, wonders so great that the wise and the proud and even a great number of devout people find it hard to credit them. Question. What aspect of your spirit is most like Mary? What aspect of your spirit is most unlike and opposed to her? Prayer Jesus living in Mary O oh Jesus living in Mary, come and live in your servant, in the spirit of your holiness, in the fullness of your gifts, in the perfection of your ways, in the truth of your virtues, in the communion of your mysteries. Subdue within me the power of flesh and demons by your Holy Spirit, for the glory of God the Father. Amen. For the night prayer, St. Louis de Montfort's Rosary Prayer. You can find it in page 72. St. Louis de Montfort's Rosary Prayer. Hail Mary! well-beloved daughter of the Eternal Father, admirable mother of the Son, most faithful spouse of the Holy Spirit, August Temple of the Most Holy Trinity, hail, sovereign princess, to whom all is subject in heaven and on earth, hail, sure refuge of sinners, Our Lady of Mercy, who has never rejected anyone. O sinful that I am, I cast myself at your feet, and I ask you to obtain for me from the God, the good Jesus, your dear son, contrition and pardon for all of my sins along with divine wisdom. I consecrate myself entirely to you along with all that I have. I take you today for my mother and my mistress. Treat me then as the last of your children and the most obedient of your servants. Listen, my princess, Listen to the sights of a heart that desires to love you and to serve you faithfully. Let it not be said that of all of those who have had recourse to you, that I have been the first to be abandoned. O oh my hope, O oh my life, O oh my faithful and immaculate Virgin Mary, graciously hear me, defend me, nourish me, instruct me, save me. Amen. This concludes day 25 of 33. Thank you for joining us.